Okay, we've got this great spring summer light dish. Fantastic goat's cheese tart using the best Somerset chore goat's cheese. Ah! We'll start off filo pastry base. Got to work quickly. This might go dry. Just fold it in half, tuck them in. Trying to make a nice circle onto the roasting tray. Into the oven, three minutes. Goat's cheese mix. Great cheese. Just break it up. A little cream. Chives. Nice and fine. In they go. Season and just mix it with a spoon. Tart case is out. Nice and golden and crisp. We don't want soggy pastry on our tart. Mixture on. Nice and smooth. Three to four minutes, 200 Celsius. Perfect. Just finely slicing the cucumber. What we're doing effectively is just pickling it really, really quickly. So we need it to chop nice and finely so you get the flavour of the vinegar all through the cucumber as quickly as possible. Cucumber and salt. And they'll be great in just a couple of minutes. Hot salad. This is great. Asparagus. Just going to trim it down. Snap it. This is woody. Makes great soup. Straight through. Great. These are ready to go. Broad beans. And my favourite, peas. Boiling water. Season it up. Next thing, broad beans. Quick cooking. 20 seconds. British peas. 20 seconds. In total, we're just over a minute. Asparagus in total, minute 10 seconds, minute and a half, and strain. Tart tart. Warm salad. Lovely rocket. And now for our great garden vegetables. In they go. Olive oil. vinegar, cider, now we're ready to play. Asparagus on first, just crisscrossing it just to give it some uh, height, some great visual depth when we build the dish. This lovely rocket, peas and broad beans just randomly scattered and now for the centrepiece, the tart. that lively, acidic cucumber. A little Somerset goat's cheese tart, just enhanced with some chives, some great pickled cucumber. Amazing.